giving you an opportunity to get the full story from the people who tell it best. This is Mediacom News Leaders. Hello everyone and welcome to Mediacom News Leaders. Thanks for tuning in. I'm Carol Kelly. Joining us today from the City of Marion, we've got Amber Bissinger. Welcome Amber. Thank you. So we are, we've got lots happening, obviously all throughout the summer. Biggest event, brand new event coming in J July. Tell us about it. Yes, we are hosting our first Fireworks and Fireflies event. It is on July 3rd, on the eve of the 4th of July, and it will be at Lowell Park. Brand new event. What goes into the creation of something that's going to be, hopefully, a signature event for Marion? You know, I think it is going to be a new tradition for Marion. Um, it grew out of our Imagine Next community visioning process. So a lot of people suggested it as kind of one of those missing things that um, Marion needed to add, and a committee of volunteers have taken it and run with it. Tell us about all the stuff that's happening that night. Essentially, it'll be food food trucks, uh, fireworks, and music, and lots of activities for kids and families to enjoy. Tell us about the music. What's going to be on stage at Lau Park? Yes, we have the Bamboozlers that will join us. They'll start playing about 6 o'clock that night. Um, a variety of food trucks will have um, life-size games, um, fun activities, face painters and balloon artists, um, kind of filling the night up until dusk when the fireworks will take place. Tell us about how the community, um, just how important it is an event like this is for the community. You know, it brings people together, and that's kind of one of the uh, fun things that we do. Our host a bunch of free events in our public spaces, whether it's music in the park, um, in City Square Park, or the concerts happening out at Lau. And this was kind of one of those events that um, we just saw the need and wanted to make it happen. Fireflies, is there a piece of that or just the fact that it's at night? You know what, <laughs> at Lau, it's a natural prairie. And so it's kind of the, um, hopefully the fireflies will be out and just add to the ambiance of the, the setting at Lau Park. You said this is a free event. Let's talk a little bit about just some of the expectations that night, obviously music and then fireworks. Yes, for sure. Um, it's free to the public. Um, we're able to do that through great community support. So we have Hannah Plumbing and Heating that has come on as the presenting sponsor. Uh, several other, other businesses that have um, also stepped forward and said we want to be part of this. What expectations are, do you have that night? Uh, for example, what should we be br bringing? Yes. Um, Coolers are welcome at Lau Park. Bring your lawn chairs, bring your blankets. Um, it wouldn't be a bad idea to throw a wagon in and make it easier to transport your items. Um, we expect a big crowd, so we're really trying to anticipate um, parking options, shuttle service, those types of things. So we'll communicate that as the event gets closer um, and just encourage people to kind of um, come out and enjoy the relaxing setting. It just can't be easy probably to pull off an, an event of this magnitude, especially mm -hmm. being 4th of July week, people are happy, families coming in to experience the city of Marion. Tell us about that. You know, um, it's kind of all hands on deck. We're working with the police department, the fire department, just to make sure we have all of our bases covered. Um, our biggest concern off, out of the gate was, is there a fireworks vendor that could even um, do a show in this busy time? But um, we found one and we're excited that we'll be able to make it happen. Talk to us about um, maybe words of advice for attendees. You know, um, I think just pay attention to um, signage and information that's communicated as the event gets closer. Um, we may have some parking um, staged at local schools around the park. So we just want to be sure um, to keep people safe um, and hope that people kind of obey the, the rules and the, the things that we've set out to um, make it an awesome night for everyone. As you continue to uh, get things finalized, is there an, a place to go that people could learn a, li a little bit more about this event? Yes, um, cityofmarion.org slash fireworks will have all that information. Our Facebook and Twitter pages as well will have the, the details, but um, really want to encourage folks to leave the sparklers, leave those dangerous things at home, um, and pets should probably stay home as well just because it's fireworks. It's fireworks. <laughs> <laughs> Again, when is this happening? The name of it and where we could learn more. Fireworks and Fireflies, July 3rd at Lau Park and learn more at cityofmarion.org slash fireworks. Just a wonderful time, Amber. Good luck. Thank you so much for joining us. Thanks a lot. This has been Mediacom News Leaders, your opportunity to get the full story from the most reliable sources exclusively on Mediacom News Leaders.